old baby, old baby. Today is a good day. We got some mail from UPS. UPS just dropped this off and my girlfriend's on the way over. I haven't seen my girl in at least five weeks. I miss her a ton. So today's gonna be a very good day. Hopefully we can vlog a little bit in today's video. I have no idea what is in this box. This thing's heavy too, man. This thing is heavy. I checked the, the like shipping tracking thing and UPS told me it was gonna be one pound, but this is like at least 20 pounds, 30 pounds right here. This is heavy. Before we open up this unboxing, huge shout out to all my Overwatch players out there. The Overwatch League is a ton of fun to watch and I'm really glad that Blizzard is running it because it just, it gives me another reason to wake up in the morning. Or in this case, stay up late at night. Let's uh, let's get into it. All right, all right. I don't know if you guys are ready. I, I don't know if you guys are ready for this. I don't even know if I'm ready for this. Oh, that, that, that was a complete, that was a fail. Oh my God. Okay, here we go. Whoa, yo. Yo, there is a ton of stuff in here. We got a uh, a letter here from Puma with my name on it. Very dope. <coughs> hear ye, hear ye. I don't know what that was about. In the new Puma X Diamond Supply Co. A hey, the new collaboration collection. Let's go, let's go. A shared passion for sport is brought to life through simplicity of design and attention to detail. Founded in the late 90s by Nicholas Terche, Diamond Supply Co. is widely recognized today as one of the biggest, most authentic skate and street streetwear brands in the country. In their debut collaboration with Puma, 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 Diamond Supply Co. brings their unique aesthetic and skateboarding credibility to Puma streetwear, fusing past and future with vintage fabric, standout color blocking, and those signature Diamond Supply Co. colors. You guys know those Diamond Supply Co. colors, that Tiffany, that Tiffany blue. There's even a little thing here. I got my name, Christian Tracksuit Season Heart Puma. Thank you, Puma. You guys freaking rock. So let's take this out of the box. Here is the box, Diamond Supply Co. It has like a vintage sort of look to it. A lot of, a lot of paper. Ooh, even the paper. There's like special paper right here, Puma Diamond Supply Co. Yo, 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 yo. Hey, these are nice, man. Puma Clydes in this Tiffany canvas upper. These are dope. Here's a closer look at the Puma Clyde Diamond Supply Co. collaboration right here. The quality on this thing looks really good all around. I like how uh, the midsole, it has like this rubber that is attached to the midsole that creeps up onto the Tiffany canvas upper. They've also included some extra laces as well. We got some like natural colored laces. They're a little on the uh, thicker side too. There's also some silver metal aglets on these laces. And yeah. here we have it. This is the very first pair of sneakers for today from Puma, this massive mystery uh, unboxing. Huge thank you to Puma for sending over these Tiffany Clydes. These are really dope. Puma included three pieces of apparel from the Diamond Supply Co. and Puma collaboration. So the very first piece of apparel that Puma sent is this Diamond Supply Co. Puma t-shirt. It is in this like lavender purple color. There's hits of that Tiffany blue on the Puma logo at the top. We also got the Puma branding right in the center. It's like half white, half Tiffany blue, really dope. And then on the very back of the shirt, it says diamonds. So it's sort of like a Jersey kind of vibe. You know, when you play sports, you got the last name on the back. Then you got the Puma branding on the top right there too. But the one really cool thing that really pops on this shirt, which I don't really see very often, is there is a checkered board print along the collar of the shirt, which is really dope as well. So this piece right here, I wanna say, isn't necessarily uh, super ideal for the fall, winter months, but when it comes to spring and summer, I'll definitely spring, I'm going to be wearing this a ton. This is going to be a nice spring t-shirt. So snow, keep on melting, snow, keep on melting. Puma gave me a warning. Puma said it's tracksuit season, and they came through with a pretty fire tracksuit right here, and it's gonna look really good with those Clydes as well. So here's a look at the tracksuit top that they gave me. It's this half purple lavender, half Tiffany blue, and beige and white tracksuit jacket. 
really clean Puma branding right there on the zipper and we got YKK zippers as well so very high quality zippers on the inside it is this white mesh lining so it's gonna be very light really easy to compact and you know throw in a bag really quickly as well and this is just gonna be a nice spring windbreaker kind of jacket a tracksuit jacket for the spring summer months they also included the bottoms for the tracksuit of course this I'm not even sure what kind of color this is but it's like that same beige color that was on the top of the jacket then when you move down the thighs along to the leg portion areas the one leg is a white and Tiffany blue color right here the other is a lavender and Tiffany uh, blue color here this really has like a throwback kind of vibe it really reminds me of like the 90s so I'm a huge fan of anything from the 90s and early 2000s so I'm gonna have fun wearing these you guys can definitely expect some pictures of me in this tracksuit on my Instagram at sneaker so make sure you follow me over there if you haven't yet already so you think that would be it right Puma already hooked it up pretty big as it is just now with the three pieces of clothing and the sneakers but no there is more there is more second letter they sent me here says the quintessential hip-hop clothing brand fubu got its start in the early 90s and has been a streetwear legend ever since this is a fact today legends collide in the puma x fubu collaboration led by fresh iterations of the suede and sugi jun yo did they did a sugi jun they did a sugi jun okay this capsule collection pays tribute to iconic fubu and puma tracksuits with bold colors hits of velour velour and a requisite dose of swaga so pretty dope thank you puma for the puma and fubu collection let's get into it right now they included i think just as much stuff if not more um, than the Diamond Supply Co. collaborations. This feels like Christmas, yo, Puma. This is, this is like a late Christmas present, essentially. This is lit. All right, so we got some clothing in here. I see a shirt. I see tracksuit top, tracksuit bottom, and I see a uh, special edition Puma box as well. You guys can expect reviews on this and the other pairs of sneakers uh, later in the week, so be on the lookout for that. I'll have those up very, very soon. But for now, on the very top of the lid, it has this right here, Puma Suede 50. And if you guys didn't know, this is the 50th anniversary of the Puma Suede. So you guys can expect several, several dozen special like limited edition Puma Suede's to drop this year. We got the Puma branding, the FUBU branding, and the Puma Suede right there. So let's pop open this box. We got some wrapping paper right here. Okay. Okay, okay. Ooh, ooh. So these right here are the Puma Suede Fubus. Man, they, they killed it on these. Black and red colorway. We got a hit of metallic gold right here where it says Puma Suede. On the very back of the shoe, there's some Fubu branding as well. Golden Puma Cat right there. And this is just really clean. Red outsole. These sort of remind me of the colorways they often use on the Puma and Ferrari uh, collections that they do. So yeah, huge thank you to Puma for these Puma Fubu the suede. These are dope. They also came with a set of red and white laces too. So you can really switch it up and make these your own when you decide what laces you want to rock with these. And this is going to look really dope with the apparel which I should probably get to right now. So first things first, let's get to the t-shirt they sent and then we'll get to the FUBU tracksuit. <laughs> There's no way this is gonna fit me. This is, this is, de <laughs> this is definitely not gonna fit me. I think this might be a woman. Yeah, this is a woman's. They, uh, I think they sent me a men's tracksuit, but I think they accidentally sent me a, uh, a woman's FUBU t-shirt right here. That's no bueno for me. That's <laughs> That's not gonna fit for me, but my girlfriend is coming over. So you know what? I think I'll give this to her But uh, yeah, this is a nice gift now for my girlfriend and uh, this is definitely something I could see her wearing really dope So thank you Puma. Now I have a gift for my girlfriend out of nowhere. She's gonna think I'm an angel now to the tracksuit right here Let's I'm pumped for this tracksuit. Oh the velour the velour. Oh Yes yeah. Oh, thank God. It's men's. It's men's because this would hurt. This would hurt me if I couldn't wear this. This is a men's tracksuit. My girlfriend can't steal this, thankfully. So here we have the tracksuit bottoms. I'll show you guys the bottoms real quick. This is in a full velour material right here. We got FUBU on the upper left panel. 
with this like patch stitched in. We have the red line going down the side. Really nice pop of color right there. And then all black velour all around. These are dope. There's also some metal lace tips as well. Moving on to the jacket. The jacket actually doesn't use a velour material. It does have the stretchy, I think, cotton kind of material though. Um, so here it is, black and red FUBU Puma tracksuit. I want to get the tag out of the way. Black and red Puma FUBU tracksuit jacket. It says Puma right here on the side with the cat in that golden metallic foil. That's the same kind of uh, metallic golden foil they use on the sneakers, so it matches perfectly. You of course have that same red stripe going down the very side of the jacket as well. And then when you swing it over to the back, we got FUBU stitched in in this like really dope, dope satin material they use for the FUBU branding gold trim. Huge shout out and thank you to Puma for sending over both of these collaborations, the FUBU collection and the Diamond Supply Co. In the comment section down below, I need you guys to tell me which collection you guys liked better, the Diamond Supply Co or the FUBU collection. With that said, if you guys want to buy any of the items I showed you guys in today's video, I'll leave links to buy them in the description down below to the Puma website. So Natty's finally here oh, in the room. Yes, I'm recording. Thanks for rewarding me. Rewarding you? <laughs> I like your haircut, by the way. It looks really nice. They so cut off a lot. Short. They yeah. Cut a ton of hair. Oh my gosh. Well, I still recognize you. So, by the way, Puma um, gave me a massive box. I'm not sure if you saw the stuff on my room earlier. Yeah, it's your room's always a mess. Hey, though. hey, don't roast me. They gave a shirt to me, oh, but little... what? A... Yeah, they sent a little, a little letter too. They sent me a woman's shirt by accident. So you get it. You get the shirt. Boom. Oh, yeah. There you guys go. That's going to wrap up today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, please let me know in the comments or hit that thumbs up button down below. I miss this girl. I haven't seen her for like five weeks. I'm not even exaggerating. I'm not exaggerating at all. So I missed her. We're going to play some Smash Bros. Like, She's like, been sick. You know how much it sucks to have your girlfriend be sick so you can't hang out with them after you've been gone for like three to four weeks? Anyways, we'll catch you guys later. If you guys haven't yet checked out the uh, recent videos, make sure you do. Please binge watch to the Japan vlogs and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.